Factorization of algebraic expression in cyclic order. Let's get started with this expression which we need to factorize. So the given expression here, the given expression is, expression is x square into y minus z plus y square into z minus x plus z square into x minus y. Now let's perform the multiplication x square into y minus z plus y square z minus y square x plus z square x minus z square y. We needed to group these terms but as there are many terms so no students might feel kind of all over the place but that's not the case. In fact we want a quadratic equation in x and that is the reason I didn't simplify the first term. I kept x square out and now I will keep this term as such x square into y minus z and look for the terms involving x. And here is plus z square x minus y square x plus z square x and then the terms without x. Those are y square z minus z square y. And from these terms we already have x square into y minus z and let's take minus x common and inside would be y square minus z square plus let's take y and z common and this will give us y minus z. If you look throughout the terms there is y minus z, here is y square minus z square, here is y minus z. Obviously this the middle one y square minus z square is a difference of perfect squares so we can factorize this x square into y minus z minus x into y minus z into y plus z plus yz into y minus z. Now you can see that y minus z, y minus z and y minus z is common throughout the three terms. Therefore, we take y minus z common leaving inside x square minus x time y plus z plus y z. And now we perform the multiplication here inside and this will give us y minus z into x square minus x y minus x z plus y z. And let's take x common from these two terms and from these two terms we'll take minus z common. This will give us y minus z into if we take x common that will give us x minus y and minus z common that will give us x minus y again. And now x minus y is common between these two terms. Therefore we take y minus z out and x minus y here into x minus z. Now because the cyclic expression has factors which are in cyclic order as well and cyclic order is like this 
if you have x, y, z. So if this is x, this is y, this is z. So y minus z, that's right. And then x minus x minus y. So we can and uh, write minus y, y minus z to z minus x into x minus y. So this is a cyclic order and these are the required factors. Let's do another question here. Example, factorize the cyclic expression, the cyclic expression and the expression here is a square into b plus c, b plus c plus b square into c plus a plus c square into a plus b plus 3a b c. So what we're going to do now, we're going to, there are, th there, at the end, if you take a look, this is 3ABC. So if we take one out of three ABCs and distribute it over the three terms, so our terms are going to look like this, A square into B plus C plus ABC plus, again, second term, B square into C plus A and again ABC plus the third term which is C square into A plus B plus ABC. So we have distributed 3ABC to all the three terms one by one. Now we have, if we perform the multiplication, this would give us a square b plus a square c plus a b c. Similarly here, b square c plus b square a plus a b c plus c square a plus c square b plus a b c. Now we have kind of three groups here. This group, this group and this group here and if we take common that is what can we take common out of this group we can take a common which will leave inside a b plus a c plus b c and if we take common b from here this will give us b c plus B A plus A C and if we take C common that will give us C A plus C B plus A B and you can see that A B plus A C plus B C and A B plus A C plus like these three terms are common throughout and we can write them a b plus b c plus c a and into a plus b plus c these are in cyclic order and is a factorization of the given expression now we are going to give one question for you to try and here Try this question on your own and if you don't know how to do it please post your question in the comment section and I'll try to answer as soon as I can. A factorize, factorize A into B squared minus C squared plus b into c square minus a square plus c into 
a square minus b square. 